Hi and welcome back to the channel. We have these three pieces of wood left over from another project. So I decided I'm going to turn them into something for my coffee bar. If you haven't yet, check out my prior video I did called Suggestions for Coffee Bar. What I'm going to be doing is adding some hooks on here, painting it, and maybe putting a design on here. So I'll have a place to hang my coffee mugs from. So stay tuned and we will show you more as this project gets underway. Hi and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be working on making a place to hang my coffee mugs from for my coffee bar. Um, this is the piece of wood I chose. I may go ahead and paint it and then just have my husband trim some off of it at each end. So here we go. I have the real brown and I also have burnt amber. I don't know why it doesn't say amber, but it's amber. U-M-B-E-R. There's that one. And there's also this one. This one looks more like a chocolatey milk. And this one is dark, like more of like an espresso. I think that's the one I'm going to use. It's the one that's darker like the espresso. Boy, this paint really is. I haven't used it in a while. a good ground to go. Then I have my paintbrush. The wood is really soaking up the paint. It's good. Just gotta do a little bit and then show you what it's looking like and then I'll do the rest and come back and I'll I'll insert a picture in to show you what it looks like before we start the next step. So keep in mind that this is not dry all the way, but you can see what it's looking like. That's what it looked like before, and that's what it's looking like now. When I get the whole thing painted, I'll come back, and I will insert a picture to show you what it looked like. And then, like I said, I'll probably have my husband trim some of that off of there, and then do some final touches to it and put the hooks on and maybe put some decor on there or some lettering or sign or something so stay tuned so what i'm doing is i have these hooks here you can pick them up at lowe's or home depot or amazon Lots of places, hardware, anywhere hardware store is. And I am placing them on this board here. And this board will eventually be hung up over my coffee bar to hold my coffee mugs and teacups. 
We drink tea and coffee. So. The best of both worlds. <laughs> so I'm using the stylus here to kind of measure the gap in between. Put it down there. Yes, it does come with a place for two screws, but right now I'm just putting one in, and then I may go back later with the second one in. Watch me end up with the odd number, which is okay with me. Seven would be great. Readjust it a little bit. video from me. I have lots of animals. <laughs> I have uh, three or four dogs and uh, goats and turkeys and chickens and all kinds of animals. <laughs> it doesn't bother me, but and then we have some indoor. My daughter has a cockatiel and she has a rabbit that's a pet. Okay, so we have one more hook to go. Looks like this is it. So we're down to the last one. Well, we wound up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We wound up with eight. Eight hooks. See? Okay. And now I'm going to go back through and put the second screw in them. And then 
I may write something on here, like coffee bar with the paint pens. Come back and show you what I've done, or I'll insert a picture showing you. Adding the second screw down now. Each one. Just helps to keep the uh, the hook from wiggling around. Come on. My measuring tape here and I'm going to measure out and mark where I want to put the lettering So it's exactly, the board is exactly 40 inches long. Kind of mark it so I would know where I want the uh, lettering to go. I have these stencil letterings here that I'm going to be using for putting a sign on top of the rack. That I just made. So for now we have our gloss acrylic paint, Apple Barrel brand. Should give it a good shake. Then I have this paper plate here. I'm gonna put some on it. And I'm going to look through my brushes. I have a lot of different brushes, so probably use one of the smaller brushes. 